I'm a Jeff Odell. I'm a fourth year mechanical and materials major. Um, September 11th really kind of inspired me to join the military. I enlisted in the Army after the event September 11th. Served uh, four years active duty Army as a Ford Observer. Did uh, two deployments to Iraq. Once I left active duty, I um, wanted to get an engineering degree because I saw so many deficiencies and shortcomings in our equipment. So I came back to the uh, University of Virginia to get an engineering degree, and this degree has given me the um, knowledge and know-how to accomplish what I needed to do to make uh, equipment better for our military, and it's brought me to where I am today. I saw a lot of, uh, I guess, deficiencies in our equipment, and I knew engineering would give me the knowledge and the tools that I needed to uh, make a difference and make changes in the deficiencies that I saw and what I really wanted to work on. This was a huge adjustment coming back from Iraq, or just coming out of the military in general to uh, adjusting to civilian life. And, and just from being deployed multiple times, I had to do it several times. And it's kind of, uh, I don't know if you learn, it gets a little bit easier as you go along, but it's definitely a huge adjustment. And I've actually talked to uh, quite a few of the veterans on campus and just trying to, I guess the, the newer uh, veterans coming in, just guide them and show them, uh, I guess, you know, showing the ropes and how to adjust and just help them along as much as I can. Well, I'd say the best part about studying here and to make the adjustment a little bit easier from military to civilian life is just my studies kept me so busy. I didn't have time to think about anything else, to be honest with you, because I had a huge break between, uh, I guess, math courses, and it was uh, just took me about a year to get caught up in calculus because it was uh, a huge adjustment for me. Well, what I'm working on now for my thesis, I'm trying to develop a, a semi-reactive type of armor. Because armor systems, there's a, you have passive and you have reactive. And um, both armor systems have uh, deficiencies and shortcomings. What I'm trying to do is develop a, a lightweight semi-reactive armor. It's kind of a hybrid of the two that uh, increase the survivability and maneuverability of our military vehicles. And uh, I guess they'll bring our uh, soldiers and Marines and airmen home safely. So I've known what I wanted to do when I came to engineering school. So I tailored my degree towards what would get me to what I wanted to get to and give me the knowledge that I would need to accomplish that and to make it happen in the real world. So it's been a great university and been a great experience for me.